You think of yourself as the king or queen. You are very independent and the world is your playground. You cherish your freedom tremendously. Your mind is unmatched on its quest for knowledge. You want to learn as much as you possibly can about everything that interests you, and that's a lot. You're very progressive in your thinking. For some, sleep is a very rare commodity. That mind of yours is always spinning out new concepts, ideas and ways to stay busy. You love to work. In fact you need to work as much as possible to stay happy. You are a taskmaster and quite masculine in your thought process. Because of your unending desire for freedom, you can be very indecisive with intimate relationships. This is mostly due to your ambition to get things done. Relationships can slow you down or hinder your progress. You have a strong spiritual side that needs to be tempered with the study of religion or philosophy. Your quest is to learn how the universe operates. Once you connect to a belief that satisfies your mind, you are committed. You have a difficult time making up your mind, which can be a very frustrating space for you. Marriage and long-term intimate relationships are a huge challenge for you. They're just too restraining on so many levels. Falling in love can be a real test, because you have to give up a part of yourself that for the most part you're not willing to do. Polyamory would be a perfect fit for you until you've faced the deep emotional problems that you need to address. Once you've done this, you may find happiness in love. All the world is a stage. You are highly artistic and that reveals itself very effortlessly in your dealings with others, your home environment and your career. Your self-expression is very original, outgoing and fun. You are very social and love nothing more than a good joke or two. You are very energetic and possess a lot of charisma and enthusiasm. With all of this positive energy at your disposal it's important to stay clear of things that really are not that important. It's the trivial things in life that can be a real downer for you. You should look into careers that involve acting, writing, performing, or anything to do with the arts. And if for some reason you're not able to do that, then you should at least have a hobby that involves some sort of creative outlet. You are very optimistic, friendly and affectionate. But on the opposite end of this you can also be a bit moody, self-involved and fall subject to feelings of depression and feeling sorry for yourself. Because you're so creative there is the potential of scattering your energy in several different directions. Try to minimize this. Learn to stay focused as much as possible. Since you were born under the astrological sign of Libra you can be idealistic, easygoing, affectionate, expressive, stylish, sincere, fair, good mediator, well balanced, sociable, romantic, creative, charming, artistic, diplomatic, and communicative, but you can also be manipulative, always undecided, flirtatious, gossipy, sulky, self-indulgent, overbearing, hates criticism, escapist, gullible, and easily influenced. Here are some suggestions on how you can bring positive change into your life, be sure of your decisions before you act, don't second guess yourself, share for the right reasons, have faith in the universe, don't talk about others, stay away from the me mentality, be real. For God's sake don't believe everything you hear. Don't give in to the willpower of others. Share. 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 And most importantly learn to love yourself and others unconditionally.